Hey, what's up everyone? In this video, I'll teach you how to level up your offense with a technique called the shimmy. Take a look at this clip here. This might look familiar to you from your online matches. No matter how many times Kami changes up her offense, the Gao player always breaks the throw and blocks Kami's attack. I'm sure you've come across players like this. You might think, wow, their defense is crazy good, but in reality, they're most likely just doing a delay throw tech. If you don't know what a delay throw tech is, then you can check out this video right here. To summarize quickly, a delay throw is a defensive technique used after getting up or blocking attacks. It will always guard immediate attacks and break immediate throws. The counter to delay throw tech is the shimmy. A shimmy is pretty much a fake out using movement. A shimmy is when we move in like we are going to pressure from point blank but then walk backwards at the last moment to take us out of the opponent's throw range. Then, if you see their throw miss, this is your chance to attack for a punish counter. A shimmy is most commonly used in three situations. After a knockdown in the corner, after a blocked normal from drive rush, and from neutral. Using a shimmy is a strong and relatively low risk way to open up defensive opponents. If done properly, it will allow you to punish whiffed throws and guard wake up reversals. The downside of the shimmy is that it can get clipped by low attacks easily if your timing and spacing is off. Also, it allows opponents to wake up with normals into drive rush. Once you start punishing your opponent for doing delayed tech with a shimmy, you'll find that many players will stop doing delay tech and switch to either pushing buttons or doing immediate throw out of frustration. If you think your opponent will start pushing buttons, this is your chance to go for an attack on their wake up or a frame trap from drive rush. An alternative to doing a shimmy is to do a neutral jump instead. Doing a neutral jump has more risk reward than a regular shimmy. Neutral jump to beat delayed tech is certainly a viable option but it isn't the focus of this video. Now that we know what a shimmy is and when to use it, I'll show you how to practice it using training mode. This can be done with any character, but I recommend practicing this with Kami first because of her fast walk speed. Trust me, it'll make the learning process much easier. Once you master it with Kami, go ahead and try this out with your favorite character. From the training mode menu, go to reversal settings and set the opponent to do a normal throw on wake up reversal. Make sure to set a 7 frame delay to mimic a delayed throw tech. Then set your opponent in the corner. Throw your opponent, walk in, then walk back just enough to get out of throw range. Then hold down back to block. If the dummies throw missed you, congrats! You performed a successful shimmy. Keep practicing this for a few minutes until you get a feel for the timing and walk back range. The next step is to practice punishing the missed throw. You should use a move that has good reach and is special cancelable. Kemi's stand hard punch is perfect for this. Now to practice the most important part. In reversal options, set both a 7 frame regular throw and do nothing. Set them both to play. Then practice your shimmy after throw again, but this time only push standing hard punch if you see the dummies throw miss. Once you walk back to get out of throw range, don't mindlessly push attack buttons. Visually confirm that your opponent whiffed the throw and then go for your whiff punish. Doing this will prevent you from throwing out normals that are unsafe on block and keeping you safe from wake up reversals and supers. Fighting games are all about conditioning your opponent and making an educated guess as to how they will react. You won't be able to guess correctly all the time but I'm sure that your win rate will improve if you master the techniques in this video guide. That's all for today's video on the shimmy. If you found this video useful, please like and subscribe to my channel. Also, let me know in the comments if your win rate improves after trying out this technique. Thank you all so much for watching. Until next time, take care.